Hi, we're 865 Operations, and our design team is working with the Tennessee Department of Transportation to replace and expand the existing bridge on State Route 34 over the CSX Railroad in Johnson City. There is currently a reinforced concrete bridge that we're replacing with a steel beam bridge that utilizes an orthotropic closed rib deck on reinforced concrete columns. The technical design work to be completed for the three-phase bridge reconstruction project involves structural substructure and superstructure design using both AISC and ACI design standards, hydrology design including drainage area analysis and drainage structure design, transportation design including right-of-way analysis, pavement design, and roadway markings and signage design, and a construction engineering work involving preliminary cost estimate, three-phase construction design plan, and construction traffic control plan. To date, A65 Operations has completed in their schematic design a prelim preliminary concept plan set, uh, the beginning steps of load calculations, hydrology analysis, shoulder taper calculations and asphalt material requirements, and the identification of construction item unit costs. Our project's purpose closely aligns with one of the National Academy of Engineers' grand challenges. These are international goals that help engineers work towards improving life on the planet. Ours closely aligns with restoring and improving urban infrastructure. By assisting in the design of an improved highway bridge, we are experiencing the importance of assisting with work that increases sustainability. 865 Operations is beholden to the global, cultural, social, environmental, and economic factors. Our primary focus is on the environmental and economic factors. In collaboration with TDOT, it is important to be good stewards of taxpayer Our money. team is excited to uphold two important outcomes of the ASC body of knowledge. We are demonstrating the outcome depth in a civil engineering area through the different aspects of design in our project. Additionally, we are getting practice in the professional attitudes outcome through our meetings and forums with TDOT. In conclusion, we are looking forward to completing this project and serving the Johnson City community. By working on this parallel path alongside the Tennessee Department of Transportation, our team is learning how to navigate a professional environment and TDOT will potentially gain improvements to apply to their design. We are happy to learn from each other and grow each step of the way. Thank you for watching.